Hello, good evening. For the last, for the last, uh, for the last few weeks or so, I've been learning all different songs that I've learned to play. And uh, now I, I may have finally finished my first song called Let It Be that was sung by the Beatles. Uh, but I'm trying to, so you can see what I'm doing, that's better. Right, I, and I'm going to play, this is my second performance I've done the last two or three weeks now, right, two, 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 between two and a half to three weeks or so. Oh, and this is it now, so this is Let It Be on the ukulele, which I'm going to play now. Thank you for listening. So that song could have been a bit, a bit longer, but you know, it shouldn't matter how long. But it's it's how you play as well. So if you, the more you, you play it clear, and for like, example, like sometimes when you play you clearly, it's important. So you so like, you know, if you go from G, if you want E seven, just so you have, you so it's on second fret, on your third and first strings. So it sounds like this. That's E seven. And this is an A seven. Which is an A minor. And to do to do an A minor, all you need is first and second fret on the and the C and, and G chord are strings. So it's, and that's A minor. If you want to, I can't believe this is a B major or B minor, but I think it's a B minor. So to do that one, it's doing this one. And to do, and to do an A, A minor, you move one finger down each one, so it's First, second, third, right, and do this. So that's an A minor. So uh, there are more other chords to learn. I do have a sheet that I can show you. Uh, that that was printed out for me previously when I went to a uh, job. So I have it with my uh, with my you know with the 
cause not to present it to share with the people who are into it. So that's that's all that's what the cause you told you clearly. Right. The right the, the maybe that's uh, that's uh, you know the chat. There might be more of it but I don't know yet. But that's that's what that's one part. So that's you know, uh when I say one part I mean like that's just what just a part of one sheet of but there might be more we don't know. So uh, so t tomorrow um tomorrow evening or when, when I come back after the town I'm going to learn another song. I know a few others right, like I know the shotgun, right, that's easy to play. And there's uh, Pink Panther. Uh, the ones I know so far is Pink Panther and Hedwig's um, theme tune from Harry Potter. Uh, Batman, right, and the theme for Batman is quite hard to learn. So, until you uh, figure out how to use your fingers, right, like, like Batman, right, um, it's quite hard to. You, all you need right, is first and second straight on your first fret, second fret on your. On the second string, so you see, so you try to do this. But you see, me, it is quite hard to learn. You, it, 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 it can be done. It just needs to be patient. That's all. <coughs> and also, um, so I do have quite a lot of other songs to learn. For example, like. Um, there's Hey Jude. Um, I think we can learn tomorrow. Um, there's one that, that I've really started to, to research so far. It's called Emily Dreams, right? It's from it's from it's from the the famous show called The Great Showman. That that's your cause for for The Great Showman for the uh, Emily Dreams. But, and the, all the codes I found are only for only are only for you clearly, right? But you, but with also with banjo, right? Banjo, well, but if you have a band banjo, right? Oh yeah, it's this right. So this is called a banjo. It's like a banjo, but it's small. It's like same size as as you clearly. It sounds different. So if you want to do a C, that's what it sounds like. So it sounds a bit more loud than it does than than, than a regular size than the you know, ukulele. But well, the ukulele right comes in different sizes. What I've got is called a concert. You can get a concert tempo uh, um, tenor um, it's a power culture, I think it's called, and and there's one on the bow bow tone as well. So you you can but all but if you were to to you a different to a different song, you can you can use a, a thing called a tuner. Uh, it's how, so you make sure your your things in tuner so you can use it, and also not all songs you play, right? Doesn't have a capo. And also, if you are having trouble strumming, right, with your hands, you can buy a thing called a, a, a plex, right? It's a, it's a, I do I, I do have one somewhere, but it's the one more because I need to buy some more. And, you know, so you, so you can, so you can help to, you know, to strum on the strings. So um, that's all. That's all for today. I can say about, and and I will say good night, and I'll see you all later.